these are the individual pixels on my monitor. I'm going to make a space shooter the size of a cursor. That was not cool. First thing I need to check is how well a single pixel shows up on my screen. Oh! Okay, this should still work. Now I just need to build a bigger player. This should work. Gotta make the controls to move the player. Perfect. But I can't let it go off screen. I'll have to make a limit. Just gotta tweak it to the right values. Okay, I've gotta add a listener for the space key so I can shoot little bullets. I can replace player with P just to simplify the code. And I'd also prefer the player to be purple. When the space key is pressed, I need to add a bullet. But I have to add a delay so we don't get 60 bullets in a second. Can you see the little bullets? They're actually kinda hard to see in this game. Time to make the little aliens. Let's make them into little green V shapes, just to keep it simple. And we've gotta make them move down towards the player which we can delay by counting the frames between movements. For the bullet collision, we need to check every live bullet's position and compare that to the pixels of each enemy. This is really starting to come together. I've got to make the enemies respawn though. Wonderful. That took a while to get the... Final step. I've got to make a game over screen for when the enemies reach the bottom. Now I just need to write game over, well then the game is over, pixel by pixel. The game is done. This is the best footage I could get with the physical pixels with my camera. I think it turned out pretty great. I just really have to squint to aim. I'm Greybeard42, and I don't have a beard.